When making a chamfer or oblique type preparation, we use the half diameter of the burr. In such margin preparations, positioning the tip of the burr is very important for gingival health. During preparation, we have to focus on the tip of the burr and try not to touch the gingiva. If we do not pay enough attention to this, when making rotational movements during preparation, the burr tip may contact the gingiva and cause tissue harm and bleeding to fail in impression making in that appointment. In order not to face with such situations, we have to analyze the contact of the burr tip with the tooth during preparation. In these burrs, there are two active parts. The first one shapes the inner line of the margin and the other shapes the outer line of the margin. When starting the margin preparation, the tip that will form the outer line should be positioned with contacting the gingiva. Thus, the margin is supragingival initially. With a secondary movement, we carry this outer margin line to the subgingival area. When we continue with margin preparation by removing all undercut areas on the teeth, our eyes should focus on the tip of the burr and we have to form the margin line without contacting the gingiva. After obtaining the margin width horizontally, we continue only with vertical preparation and replace the margin subgingivally.